Hi, this is Randy Kirk, and um, I want to do a little housekeeping today. So let's start off with, uh, do you like this camera better? Um, the other one, um, you know, has a nice kind of foggy look on it. So maybe it takes away some of the wrinkles. I don't know. But folks have been asking about the camera. I was using my laptop camera. Now I'm using my cell phone. If you like this better, yeah, put it in the comments below. What I really want to talk to you about is the lineup. I want you to I want you to subscribe right now. I want you to hit the notification button because you're going to want to see what I've got coming up. Uh, we're going to start with uh, maybe two. Who knows? It's going to be a long form interview with Brian Wong. And what we're going to be doing with Brian is he is one of the most. Uh, how can I say it? People don't understand what a treasure he is to the to the Twitter sphere uh, around Elon and around Tesla. Uh, he does amazing deep dives. He's a real actual scientist. He's a futurist. We're going to look into his background. We're going to look into why you should pay attention to Brian, why you should subscribe to his channel as well. Um, I think this interview is going to just knock your socks off because this guy, you won't, you won't find another YouTuber out there that does the kind of deep dives that he does with the science backing up, up all the way. Then we're gonna follow that up. We're gonna do uh, a, 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 an interview with uh, Billy Sony, um, and Sonny, Billy Sonny. Uh, he wrote the book about the founders. Um, mostly it's around the PayPal uh, whole situation with x.com and PayPal. Um, I certainly uh, have read a tremendous amount about this in the past and cover a lot of it in the Elon Musk method. If you haven't purchased a copy of the method yet, you probably should go out and buy a copy of the Elon Musk method, where I talk about the characteristics, the style, the skills, uh, the capabilities of Elon Musk, 16 things that he does that you could incorporate into your life, especially if you're a business owner, especially if you're a manager, uh, things like uh, getting, the, getting the, the mission right, being able to communicate the mission, uh, leadership skills uh, in terms of hiring and managing people. Anyway, um, but we're gonna be looking at this book, The Founders. We're gonna be looking at uh, Billy's kind of his background, why he writes what he writes, why he decided to write about uh, Elon Musk and about the founders of, uh, of the various companies that Elon has uh, started. Um, and I think, uh, I think it's gonna be an amazing, amazing, uh, 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 interview that we're going to do with him. Then we're, we're working on, I mean, we've already got an agreement. I think it's going to be next Monday uh, with, uh, with uh, Dylan at Electrified. Um, Dylan Loomis, uh, in my opinion right now, is doing the best job of the daily news reporting on YouTube. Oh, sure. I love Steve Mark Ryan and I love Ron, you know, uh, Rob Maurer, uh, Dave Lee. I mean, I, all these guys are doing great. You know that I have a, um, a, a great deal of respect for Warren Redlick. Um, but um, right now, uh, Dylan Loomis at Electrified is doing a great job. Uh, he's got a very big finance background um, and he uh, takes the daily news and he gives great quick opinion context to the news as it's breaking. If you're not watching Electrified, I just highly recommend it, but I'm gonna do a, a long form interview with him as well. Uh, and we're gonna really take a look at uh, what his, um, how he got in the game, why he's in the game, et cetera, et cetera. Then we're gonna do a uh, joint YouTube video uh, with Herbert Ong. Um, uh, if you're not watching his stuff, he does some great stuff. He does interviews. Um, uh, his channel is uh, really growing quickly and you're seeing him a lot in the uh, spaces. Uh, he's a thoughtful entrepreneur, another person who has an entrepreneurial background. He started a couple of very successful businesses, so he comes at it from that standpoint. And uh, we're going to talk about the catalysts uh, for 2023. Uh, it's one thing to be in a position of knowing something that the rest of the market doesn't understand and having an arbitrage opportunity because you can buy low when the market hasn't yet figured out what's going to take place. But it's another thing to kind of figure out what are the catalysts that might spring that loose. So Herbert Ong and I are going to talk about those catalysts. 
Um, I've identified uh, bunches of catalysts and Herbert will add a few of his own. Anyway, I think that that interview is gonna be uh, also just fantastic. These will be coming out over the next week. Um, and we're looking for more uh, really top talent that I feel can contribute to your understanding, your knowledge, uh, my understanding of my knowledge of what's going on with Tesla, what's gonna probably go on in the new year with Tesla. So anyway, uh, give me thoughts, people you'd like me to look out to as possible interviews, uh, people that you think I should, oh, I forgot one other one. Oh yeah, I forgot there's one more. I am working with uh, Dr. John Gibbs. Uh, as you know, he was another one of the authors of the book, The Elon Musk Mission, uh, as was, uh, as was um, uh, uh, yes, oh my goodness, as was Brian Wong. Um, anyway, uh, Dr. Gibbs, uh, who goes by Dr. Know-It-All and has a great channel as well. Um, definitely, sh you should be watching his channel. Anyway, he has this robot expert that he works with. And um, you may have seen some of his, the long interviews that he did with that robot expert. I'm going to get both of them on at the same time. I want to talk about what is the reality that my idea is correct, that we're going to see hundreds, if not a thousand um, Optimus robots built uh, in 2023 um, as samples, as working models, um, as, uh, as uh, you know, as the prototypes that will be used to get a line started, maybe even by the end of the year, a line, a, a line to start making them in production. Um, these guys are both extremely expert in their crafts. Uh, and I think that interview is gonna be great too. So there's five upcoming interview deep dive situations that I hope that you'll find great. If you think those are gonna be great, subscribe and hit the notify button so you won't miss any of them. Anyway, buy the books, you know what, you know, you know what to do. Join Patreon. The Patreon thing is gonna be just as good as this content, even better. You're gonna to wanna to be on Patreon and we will have all of those interviews up on Patreon before we put up on, on YouTube. So that's it for now. It's been great talking to you.